what is up everybody wow <laughs> wow 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 visa just came out with a major announcement that changes the games for the entire crypto world specifically for nfts and this could mean 100x returns on a number of investments moving forward you're definitely not going to want to miss out on this because this is one of the biggest announcements we have ever seen in crypto in like a new space which is nfts um, so today's video we're going to go over everything you need to know i might get shot for telling you this so look i'm wearing my weighted vest this is a big deal so we're going to go over everything going on why it's important and just everything about nfts so first of all visa came out on twitter on august 23rd 2021 and they came out and said that over the last 60 years they have collected a number of rare commerce artifacts they said they have collected the first paper credit cards they've collected the zip zap machine and as of august 23rd 2021 they have officially added an nft to their collection they said they added they bought they purchased CryptoPunk number 60, 7610, 7610, and they added this to their collection. They spent 49.5 Ethereum, which is right now sitting around like $165,000, $170,000. And this is a huge deal because everyone's like, oh, NFTs are scams. NFTs, um, aren't really going anywhere they're just made so people can make money they're not real but by visa actually going ahead spending $165,000 on them adding it to the same collection the same conversation as the first ever credit cards this shows you how much they believe in it they go on to say that they support all of the collectors all of the artists all of the creators in the nft space and they think we are just in the beginning. They wanna get involved in it, and this is huge. So for those who aren't familiar, NFTs are called, stand for non-fungible tokens. Easiest way to think about it is an NFT is simply a digital collectible. Think of it like a piece of art. Some people might think a piece of art is worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. You'll see it hanging on a wall in their house, and other people might say, I only paid $100 for that. Art is subjective. Everyone has a different opinion on it. Same with NFTs. While they are just little JPEGs, little PNGs, little images on your computer, on your phone, people like to collect them. Some people are willing to spend more than others. And that is why you see prices of some be worth more than others. Some are more rare than others as well. But so the easiest way to think about it is NFTs, it's just like digital art and people like to collect them they're already working on ways that people could display these in their house using like holograms things like that but this is huge over the last week or so um between august 14th august 21st 2021 we saw that we saw that nfts brought uh, like about 220 million dollars were spent on nfts between august 14th and august 21st 2021 220 million dollars out of the biggest projects about 80 million dollars was spent on a project called um like an art project block about 30 million dollars was spent on crypto punks about 30 million dollars were spent on the bored apes yacht club and these are just a couple of the biggest projects. Some of the ones that I've been looking at and that I own are particularly CryptoPunks, Bored Apes Yacht Club, and Pudgy Penguins. Right now, there are a lot of projects in this space. Some of them are extremely valuable. You can't get them for less than $100,000, $150,000 per like NFT. Others are worth a couple hundred dollars. But either way, what we do know now is that visa getting into this space shows us that nfts aren't going away anytime soon they are putting it in the same category as credit cards and to even be considered and put in the same category the same collection as credit cards shows you 
that NFTs are on the ground floor, just getting started. And we're gonna see a number of these projects really pop off and yield 100X returns for people. So projects that I own, like I said, are CryptoPunks, Bored Apes Yacht Club, Pudgy Penguins, but there are plenty others out there. Let me know what you guys think. Have you been looking into any projects recently? Have you gotten involved? Or are you a good artist and want to actually make NFTs yourselves? You can always hit me up on Instagram. I've been working on a couple projects myself as well. But anyways, wanted to get this out to you guys, let you know what is going on with NFTs, what is going on with this announcement from Visa. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please be sure to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.